What's up guys, it's your boy Jay from JS Films and today we're gonna do another low light test. We all know the A7S II is the king of low light, but uh, my good friend Lembonic has the Sigma 1835, so I wanted to go ahead and borrow it from him. He's actually the one walking around. But I wanted to see how the GH5 does, how well it will perform against the Sony A7S II, which is this footage right here with the Sigma 1835 F1.8 with a speed booster. So this is the footage to beat, this one right here. The next one is gonna be the GH5 with a base ISO of 400 F1.1. This is speed boosted Sigma 1835. It's not looking good. It doesn't look like it's gonna beat the Sony A7S II at 400. So I went ahead and cranked it up to 800 coming up here. Okay, so this is the ISO 800, same thing, F1.1, Speed Booster Sigma 1835. Doesn't look that bad, but it's not as good as the Sony A7S II at 1600. Just to let you guys know, S-Log2 for Sony, 1600 is the base ISO. Okay, so this is a pretty good comparison. Same ISOs, 1600, the only difference is F1.1 for the GH5, F1.4 for the Sony. Doesn't look bad, but we're gonna see it normalized here with some lift gamma gain and some saturation. Um, big up to my man, Limbonic Media, by the way. He's helping me out again. It's cold out there and he was walking for me, so it's tough. So here's the normalized image of the A7S II at 1600 and I'm using the Canon 35 1.4 LNs. That looks, that looks great, man. That's, that's tough to beat, but it's the same footage as the S-Log1. This one is just normalized. That looks pretty good. So now what I'm gonna do is normalize the GH5 1600 ISO as well. So it's coming up. Here it is, normalized. F1.1. I mean, it doesn't look that bad either, but it does have that advantage of it being an F1.1. But that's not bad. That's pretty decent. So I'm gonna be doing another test, another scene here. Same exact thing. So this one right here is gonna be the S-Log. 1.4 wide open at 1600 because like I said, that's the base ISO for S-Log for the A7S II. That is a clean image. Clean image. Now this one is the GH5 at 1600. I didn't even bother with the 800 ISO and 400 because it was just no match. So this is the F1.1 at 1600, the GH5 V-Log. And now we're gonna normalize the Sony A7S II. Simple lift gamma gain and a little bit of saturation. Actually, desaturated it a little bit. And this one is the normalized GH5. Noticing a little bit more noise. But yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching.